Damn, dude. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Alright, time to continue the Abbot's Gambit. Let's see. The instruments of the ancient. Find out where Fulke and Sigurd are. Find and get the message. Okay. Wait. Yeah. Dover. The emissary is somewhere here. Perhaps I can find the letter without bloodshed. The Bard said paladins trained at this fortress. This will not be an easy fight. Yeah, it should be fine. There's a lot of treasure here. Holy crap. What do you see, Sunan? See, somewhere near the. Carry the king's word, but there's no hand to put it in. I can offer the rest of the West Saxons appoint Thane Tedman as the elderman of the territory of Chent. May he serve me as God in lands. Alfred's chosen elderman okay. is a Thane called Tedman. The abbot Kinnebert will want to know. You will pay. Time to die. The idiot. Press hard. I'm not much longer. <laughs> 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 I should meet Bassem and the Abbot in Fulkenston. With me! Oh, what the fuck? Come on! What the fuck, bro? Keep pressing! Bassem and the Abbot in Fulkenston. Stop clucking like a laying hen. I'm the one with a broken leg. At least grab old Hisser's tail while you're up there. Something is hissing. You're moving on those 
Someone is stuck. My brother, chasing some foolish legend that if you see old Hisser from above and catch his tail, he will grant you a wish. And what of your leg? Likely sprained, trying to climb up to rescue him. <laughs> we are a sorry pair. <laughs> it's funny you, huh? Damn, bro. All right, all right. Well, you'll have to get down somehow. Can you see a haystack or something? A haystack? Are you mad? From this height? That certain death? <laughs> no, my fate is sealed. I will just wait up here to die. Yeah, bro. One. I'll help you down, but I was a big strong Norse like yourself afraid of heights. And snakes! <laughs> I don't know how I let my brother talk me into these schemes. I think I just give in to his endless golding. But I'm sick to the back teeth of him. Climb up on it. Go in that cave of wolves on it. Eat that <laughs> red mushroom. Siblings oh are a source of great joy and equal misery. I too have a brother. Does yours put you in the moor of death every opportunity he gets? Come, let's get you down, and perhaps you can tell him how you feel. Talk of my feelings to my brother? I would rather let the snakes gnaw on my tender parts. This way? It's too high Jeez. to get down from here. Let's go down the ladder, bro. There, the ladder. Watch your step. You down, right? Which way now? This way? There! Another slithering devil waiting to get me. There's no more snakes, bro. Relax. Yes! I'm alive! Brother! Fuck. What's happening? Oh, snake. Yes! Hello. I'm alive! Brother! Thank you, stranger, for bringing this waste of breath back to me. You're welcome. But what is the story you spoke of? Old Hisser? A pretty legend. He who catches all his tail will find their heart's wish granted. We have followed England's legends and found little but peril. It's time to hang up our well-worn boots. Farewell. May Odin litter your path with riches. Goodbye. Keep each other safe. For a good brother is the truest treasure from the gods. Now see, you big lump. All that wailing, it was as easy as a hop and a jump. <laughs> Keep that up, and I'll leave you here for the wolves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Look at your leg. Is it truly broken? No, sprained is all. But I'd like to see you get by without me. Couldn't even climb down a ladder without mewing like a newborn. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's talk to these dudes. Ah! Yeah, oh, it's just your skill and all of sometime. You must. My Abbey brings the best in Kent. It certainly sounds worth the risk of my immortal soul. Ah! Your god is rather a hard taskmaster. And your god forbids the mixing of wool and linen. It sounds to me like he's never heard of England. <laughs> Not all that is written in the scriptures is God's honest truth. I do a roaring trade at Reculver and Tunbridge. They pay well for my catch. The monks? Do those parchment-skinned Christians ever eat meat? Don't you believe in Jesus? They refrain because he died for our sins. 
No one will stop me sucking the marrow from a nice leg of lamb, not even God's seed. Well, I hope eternal damnation is worth it. Eivor, you have news? Kent's new elderman will be Thane Tedmund. Tedmund? Oh, the Lord is testing me. He is made mouse by you Danes. Barely leaves his fortress at Rusister. How might I gain his influence if he will not speak to me? Or to anyone? It is a puzzle. To inspire loyalty, Tedman must owe you something. Such is his life. Go on. A fortress stormed. A man kidnapped. If you beat back his enemy, saved him from sure death, his gratitude would be... Swell. It would know no bounds. But that fortress will be harder to pry open than a nun's knees. Perhaps... Perhaps not. Do you know Basim kidnapped someone close to him? Take him Are you purchase. hiding something, Basim? There is a lumber mill nearby, correct? Bemisfield. Alfred invests much in fortifying Wessex and uses our forests to do so. The mill provides his wood. Tedmund is there. Impossible! How do you know? I heard rumors that Tedman had been lured out of self-exile to manage work on the fortifications of Canterbury. Taking him from a lumberyard is less dangerous than assaulting a fortress, but your rescue attempt will not have the same flair. Is it worth it? It may still work. Yes. Yes. Bring him to the Megaliths. And Fulke? When I have Tedman's fealty, you shall have Fulke. Now go. I will rustle up a small rescue party. It's rare to see Abbot Kinnebert down this way. Abbot who? You know, the rich one. The monastery that brews ale. He keeps half the menfolk in the county from their wives. Ending up with an ale-soused wastrel is another reason to have not taken a husband. If you're waiting for a sober one, you'll die an old maid. I'm wary of this abbot, Basim. He is self-serving and evasive. Can he really deliver Fulke? The abbot is a friend of Fulke's. That is clear. So long as he doesn't suspect our motive, we may have a chance. Indeed. This brings to mind a story. Perhaps you've heard of it. The Scorpion and the Frog. A children's story? A cautionary tale. The Scorpion wants to cross the river, but he cannot swim. So he enlists the help of the Frog. The frog agrees to carry him on his back, extracting a promise that the scorpion will not sting him. Let me guess, the scorpion Rene explaining his nature and both drown. The scorpion crosses the river and stings an innocent man, killing him. So what does this tale tell us? That your stories are clouded and their meaning doubly so? It shows that every <laughs> tale has a thousand possible outcomes, many of which are surprising. If the abbot does not deliver Fulke, he will die at my hand. And we will continue our search. A sobering approach. <laughs> yeah, it works for me. Yeah. Bemisfield is just ahead. Lead. I will follow. Alright. Go, my eyes. So close to finishing this area. He's gonna be in that house. Case will catch us a plump hen. Once the abbot has Tedman's gratitude, he will deliver Fulke. It will cost us nothing more than this. If that leaden wit keeps his word, need to cloak myself oh. here. You prefer to work in the shadows. Oh, that's 
that guy just run after him while he's on a horse? What the fuck? That's so ridiculous. This place is heavily guarded. Time is coin and you're spending mine. Do you dare to question the orders of the great Thane Tedmund? I will have you flogged. Come on, you lazy hounds. I don't pay you to lollygag. I could throw a stone and hit a dozen men and do a better job than this. Flay off of their waist. Damn No! No! Protect me! Fuck you. Come back. Bitch. Back here. The Lord will see us prevail. Yo. Holy shit. Yo, 
Hold on. I should not be seen You're in mine. this area. <laughs> How do I? Come on, man. <laughs> Nobody else. Play fucking... off of the waste sweater. There you go. I am not who you think I am. Let me go. Stop caterwauling, and you live. Live? Oh, saints protect me. Silence will save you, Tidman. Silence, not your saints. <laughs> If they see me, this will get messy. Are you ready? We hide in plain sight. Such is our way. But only until the moment of success, the final strike. I prefer to act and speak plain. Kings and lords who do not are often misunderstood. Yet, as a leader yourself, you cannot deny that subtlety and intrigue are a cloak you must wear. How many of your clan know the true circumstances of Sigurd's absence? Hmm. You see my point. A leader must know when to speak and when to stay silent. For silence is not always a lie. It can feel like one. You truly embrace the concept of hiding in plain sight, eh? To its very fullest. As I do in everything. Danes, in the name of Alfred, King of Wessex, I demand you release his royal subject <gasps> into my care. Come no closer, Christian, else your man dies by my blade. Please, I I'm not the man you want. Hmm? Keep your eye on this one. He'll be worth a hefty bounty. Any false moves and I will snip your heels. We have your man. Now let's finish this shadow play and be gone. Are you sure that's Tedmund? He's dressed as a lord, but that man is shorter and fatter than I recall. I'm not Tedmund. I, I, I'm not. I, I swear upon the holy rood, I, I am not Thane Tedmund. What in heaven's name is happening here? Who are you? Speak quickly or I'll slit your throat and leave you for the crows. Shergar. I, I'm called Shergar. Lord Tedman pays me a measly coin to serve as his double. Brother Shergar, you are far from Augustine's priory. I, I left the cloisters many moons ago, Your Holiness. The monastic life was not my calling. Wow, you will get us Tedman. There's only one path. Brother we can Shergar. use you yet, Shergar. Summon Tedman to a meeting. Get him out in the open. Tedman has no care for me or what I have to say. My orders come by letter, never by mouth. I hardly know the man. You're of no use to us then. <laughs> Perhaps I should just kill you, here and now. No, no, wait, 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 wait. wait. Let, let, let me think, let me think. Oh, Danes, T to storm the walls, you need Danes. Th there's a raiding camp west of here I was told to be wary of. I acting as Tedmund, I, I ordered a band of soldiers to capture them. If you hurry, you may be able to stop this. If another band of Danes wants to join our assault, We'll have the distraction we need to get inside Roosester. If the Saxons don't slaughter them first. I, I am still Tedman to the men in the field. I could speak with their captain, send his men away. It's a fearless plan. The Nornia knit winding paths that cannot be unknotted. It seems Roosester was always in our path. Abbot, stay alert. We will send word when we're ready to capture Tedman. And this fool? He knows much of our plan. Do what you want with him and say with us. Do what you want with him. I won't risk our plan on the shambling of this fool. Come, Brother Shergar. And perhaps today would be the time to consider a vow of silence? An army of Danes are all we need to take the fortress. Let us hope.